Hi, this is Armando Cruz, creator and founder of Cruz Country Fitness and Physical Therapy. And I am currently taking a little walk with my little buddy over here. Say hi. Hi. Well, yep, my little buddy Aiden. We're going for an afternoon little stroll here around the block. That's why you see all these houses around. And I thought I'd take this opportunity to share a special message and that is this first of all you are enough you are amazing and you are worth it okay i hope that doesn't sound too cheesy for you but here's the truth if you don't believe that anything and everything you do will fall short because you are worth it right now you are an amazing person right now you don't have to wait for something else and when you can start from a place of love you can move on if not you're gonna be dragging the past with you I'm sharing this because I recently had a conversation with um, a friend of mine who struggled with his weight for a long time still struggles and he constantly finds himself starting and stopping starting and stopping maybe you can relate and he you know in that conversation we 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 started kind of breaking it down like what really is the the issue for him and one of the things that really stood out was every time he starts he starts with the most difficult things he starts with the things that he doesn't really like, the things that are, are are the things that he thinks he should be doing, but he really doesn't like doing. And I would encourage you to reflect on the, the areas in your life where you're successful and how many of them do you start with the things you hate doing, the things you really suck at doing, right? I'm gonna guess, I'm gonna go out on a limb that probably none of them, if not very few, most of them come from a place of love, which is, brings me back to the original message, right? They come from a place where you have a core belief that number one, you can do it and you're, you're somebody that's worth doing this for. And when you start from that place, you'll find that it's a lot easier. And so if you think about, and I'm going to use the example here, trying to lose weight, if you hate doing exercise or you hate going to the gym, let's make it more specific. Let's say you hate going to the gym. It's just a big burden. You just really don't enjoy it. But you enjoy hiking or being outside. Well, why is the first place that you're going to start doing the things that you really dislike so why would you start going to the gym you know don't negate if you go out for a walk that that's something that's moving you forward think about it like this if you're if you are building a hill right if you're building a hill with sand if you're in the beach you can choose to put one grain of sand at a time or you can put a shovel full of sand at a time to create this hill obviously the shovel full is gonna be more apparent and it's gonna be quicker to get that hill but here's the thing very often just by putting one grain of sand consistently over the days day in and day out day in and day out it takes very little effort right you don't have to carry a huge load you just put in the work, you put in the experience. And that's what people don't realize is that they try to start with, they haven't conditioned their body and they try to start with the huge shovel loads of sand. And they mentally, physically, emotionally fatigue real quick. And so, yes, they got a, a jump start first week but after the first week, they're exhausted. They can't continue. But the person that's been putting the grain of sand 
has very little effect on his life. It's 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 almost it's almost um, what is the word I'm looking for inconsequential to their life. Like it really has no big bearing, no big effect on their life. But they can do it consistently. So if you think about it, over a year, that's 365 grains of sand. Doesn't seem like much, but you keep adding that up consistently year after year. And two things will happen. You have created the, the habit. You also have created the, the endurance and the strength for it. So, you know, when you start seeing, hey, you know what? This isn't so bad. Maybe I could do two grains of sand and three grains of sand. So it's not linear. All of a sudden you start progressing. And before you know it, you're actually shoveling whole, um, like doing a whole shovel full of sand at a time. And it's not a problem because you've built the foundation. So the moral of the story of this is start small, start with the things you love and be consistent with them. Start from a place of love and a place that you know that you're worth doing this for. And I can guarantee you that you'll have more longevity, you'll have more fun, you'll have more fulfillment, and you'll have more success. This has been Armando Cruz, and I'll see you in the next video.